All right, guys, if you was watching previously, uh, my last video, I was working on my AC and heater control panel in my... Uh, so at the end of that video, you notice that I just cut the video off, but I mean, it was pretty self-explanatory what was left to do. Um, it was two seven millimeters to uh, put in in the bezel. But anyways, it was just blowing out of my defrost and I was so frustrated. I just ended the video. I don't know, man. Uh, I've been just, I don't know. You just get tired of fooling with stuff. But anyway, so let me show you what it's doing real quick. For the people that hadn't seen that video, let me turn so it. I'm going to cut my key on. Go ahead and have that all the way up. So, there is no AC whatsoever coming out of here. But it's only coming out here in this defrost. So, I'm going to show y'all how to fix that issue. A lot of these early model, um, you know, 2000, early 2000s vehicles, late 90s, whatever. They were uh, controlled by vacuum. That was that was what switched was vacuum, and and I'm not sure if this is going to 100% fix it. Uh, I know this is probably a common part that goes out, and and it's 20 years almost. It's 18 years old, so it's about that time. Um. Anyways, so there's the part right there. I noticed it didn't have the it was missing something so i was like well maybe that could have something to do with it but here it is right here people this is the piece yeah that's the same exact part believe it or not but <laughs> that's what i'm gonna change out hopefully this video helps y'all out uh hopefully it helps me out too we are about to figure it out so here we go it's cut out i pulled it out the groove um just to you know make it more accessible off is take one hand see if i can't set it up where y'all can see it oh the best way that i had to do it was i took one hand and while i was pulling on it pulling on it i really can't show y'all i was shaking the other one and pulling on it and that one came right off so this one's obvious where it's gonna go it ain't a 90 but these may be a little different let's see if i can't see this one Wait a little bit. Pull on. Oh, that one's on there a little bit harder. That puppy is on me. Whew. Just know that the, the two clusters together is going to go up top. They're complete 90. Oh, oh there we go. Heck yeah. <laughs> yeah, you guys, you may feel like you're going to break something because you really have got to tug on these things in order to really get them off and some of them just ain't gonna want to go anyway so you see i got i got that off i just got one more and of course the uh <laughs> the last one's gonna be the biggest bitch. So basically, God, I wish I could see my hand. Basically, what I'm doing, there's gotta be a better place. Set this up. I'm trying to set this up the best way that I can. Alright, let's see. Oh no. <laughs> God bless. Oh, come on, Camaro. Help a brother out, man. Help a brother. All right, so you see it here? <laughs> All right, I got it twisted in there. I'm just starting to twist it now. Should loosen it up a little bit. There it goes, yep. Oh, telling y'all, that's more of a B-I-T-C-H than you think it would be. And, dang man, I don't, I don't see 
no real signs of it cracking honestly as bad as I hate to say it I figured maybe once I get it off I better tell better but you know what we're gonna try it out anyway so let's see here's the new part right here the 90 these two that are close together they're gonna be faced upwards they're gonna go up top let's see what it'll do okay all right i tell you what it, it goes in a lot easier than it comes out I'm gonna go ahead and mount it since it's so easy just to mount that sucker. Mount it, whatever. Make sure everything's on the tight still. Let's test it out. This is my brother's GA. Let's go. He's trying to start. Ooh. So let's get in this thing as dirty as can be. But I'm gonna see. Turn that ball off. I don't want no jinx. I don't want jinx in there. video helps you out a lot um now look if that don't fix your issue you got a lot more going on man they have a lot of actuators in these i don't even believe these have um i don't even believe these have blendor actuators i think they just have four different actuators across um that that work the different vents and stuff if i'm not mistaken i could be wrong i, I, I believe that's what i've heard um but luckily for me it was just that that one vacuum line. We do have a lot of vacuum lines up in here. I don't know if you can really see them. I can barely see them right now. Well, but they're like right back here. You can always check those if it doesn't work. Uh, if it doesn't fix it. But it was just that three or four dollar part that I got from uh, O'Reilly's that fixed it. So hopefully this video helped you out. Did it help you out? Okay, sweet. She already got. It. She knows the deal. But um. So yeah, that was the issue, guys. I just um, like and subscribe, and uh, let me know if it helps y'all out. Heck yeah.